What is going on today? I have some Kaiser folding knives I'm going to be showing you. Make sure you watch until the last two because those are probably the best two folding knives that I have seen from Kaiser. Anyway, let's just get right into it. So the very first Kaiser knife I'm going to show you, this here is the Kaiser Lat. We have the Drop Point S35VN blade with the stonewashed finish. The blade can be deployed by the flipper tab or the front flipper tab. And then the scales, one scale is titanium and the other is G10, interestingly enough, because honestly, I can't tell the difference between the two scales. I mean, obviously the titanium scale is the lock bar side. Lock bar is easy to get to and has an access cutout for it. Pocket clip works well. Ergonomics are good, fits nicely in your hand. One thing I have to complain about is the design of the flipper tabs. Yes, both of them. First of all, the traditional flipper tab is complete trash, and you can barely get the proper amount of leverage on it. And then the front flipper tab is decent, but I find myself failing when trying to deploy using the front flipper tab. For the price point, I think it should be a little easier to deploy the blade, to be honest. And then the next one on the list is the Kaiser Critical here. So on this one we have the black coated worn cliff blade in 3V steel. The blade can be deployed from the thumb studs, G10 scales and backspacer, deep carry pocket clip which is non-reversible. We have the liner lock which is easily accessible. Blade drops shut pretty smoothly but one thing I don't like is the opening detent is very stiff causing the thumb studs to be slightly painful to use. And if you thought you were going to reverse flick this knife open, then just know it's probably not going to happen. <laughs> this problem could maybe fixed with some minor tuning. The ergonomics are pretty good. And overall, this knife has a good design. This one here is the Kaiser Montanzas. We have the interesting modified Tanto blade constructed from S35VN steel. The blade has a satin finish and is deployed from this here flipper tab. Titanium skills with micarta inlays. Lock bar is easy to get to. Pocket clip works fine, though it's non-reversible. One thing to complain about here, the flipper tab. Like, just look at this. Like, why not make it a more prominent angle so you can get more leverage on it? Like sometimes it feels fine to deploy and other times I've tried it, I really just couldn't get the blade to come out. This factor alone is a deal breaker for me on this knife, which is unfortunate considering everything else is pretty spot on. Alright, now these last three knives I'm going to show you are knives that I personally would consider buying. So this next knife is the Kaiser Mini Sheepdog, but this is a slip joint version. We've got the double detent. So you can get this knife in a flipper version that locks, but this version is a double detent slip joint. And this is probably the most sleek slash useful slip joint I've seen. And it's something I would carry. We have the Warren Cliff 154CM blade which is open from the reverse flick or with the two hand option. Skills are micarta. We have an excellent design for the pocket clip. It's deep carry and the screws along with the clip are recessed. The action is snappy and satisfying despite it being a slip joint. You can actually close this knife one handed. Ergonomics are really good in several different grip positions. The second to last knife is the Kaiser Stealth Front Flipper. Here's another great one I would buy and carry. This is the Kaiser Stealth. The name I think is very suiting. Sleek S35 Warren Cliff Black Washed Blade, which is effortlessly deployed from the front flipper tab here. Titanium scales, lock bar has an access cutout making it easy to get to. Ergonomics are amazing even though it is a smaller knife and then when closing the blade drops shut very smoothly. And then the last of the six knives I'm going to show you and this is by far the best one. This is the Kaiser Lan. I saved the best Kaiser knife for last. Now this isn't the best in the sense that it has the most premium materials. 
it is just the best because it is my personal favorite out of these Kaiser knives I've shown you. So we have the very sleek N690 blade with the beautiful satin finish. Micarta scales with frag pattern milling. Super comfortable steel lock bar with access cutout. The blade is unbelievably drop shut. The flipper tab is very well designed and easily deploys the blade. Ergonomics are very nice. And then we have the deep carry pocket clip. Alright, so that is all the Kaiser knives I have for you. Let me know in the comments which Kaiser is your favorite, even if it's not one of these I have showed here. Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my daily content.